I never thought I would see the day when we would be having a discussion about marijuana. Because in the past... It, people were in their corners, you know, it was... It was no marijuana legislation at all, ever, and we want to legalize marijuana. But now there are bills from Democrats and Republicans pushing to legalize marijuana, and a bipartisan measure would decriminalize it. And it means that people are being more open-minded and ready to compromise. Senate Minority Leader Janet Bewley said in the past, Republicans tabled any discussion about legalizing marijuana. Just one year ago, Republicans removed Governor Tony Evers' provision to legalize marijuana. Less than a year later, two Republican senators introduced a bill to legalize medical marijuana. What has changed since even last year when this bill was shot down when Governor Evers proposed it? I think it's the fact that people have a fatigue now of arguing. They have a fatigue of having to deal with constant negativity. Although there is marijuana momentum, it likely wouldn't pass this year. Not right now, but not never. Republicans control the state Senate. Majority Leader Devin Lamahue said in the past he believes legalizing marijuana should come from the federal level, saying this last April. You know, I think there's some societal concerns that you have to consider with that. Well, first of all, we don't have support from the caucus. Courtney joins us now live. So Courtney, has Senator Lemahue changed his stance since those Republican senators proposed their bill to legalize medical marijuana? Joyce, I spoke with his spokespeople at his office today. They told me they are unaware if he has changed his perspective, but they would get back to me on that this week after speaking to him. Some more on it. Uh, however, Senator Bewley does hope that they reintroduce all three bills when they come back into session. Courtney Sisk reporting live.